Hello, this is 4 Solutions, and I'm going to teach you how to save a lot of space. So, as you can see here, available, 7 gigabytes, and uh, I'm going to change that. So, all you need is a rooted Android device. Any device, it doesn't have to be like the NVIDIA Shield, but any device. You need a rooted Android device and a pretty big SD card. Mine is uh, 63, or I think, gigabytes, 64, something like that. Anyway, uh, you need that and a folder mount. I recommend getting the Pro version, but I just... I I got the APK and downloaded it so it's free for me, so I got the free pro version. Sounds weird. Anyway, so open folder mount and look as you can see I have all my games here. It's really easy. So uh for an example, this is Amazing Spider Man. Basically what it does is that it links it moves the files to your SD card so that your internal storage isn't filled up with stuff, but you can still play games that are usually, you know, made to be on the internal storage and it plays perfectly fine. It's all good. So you click add. You type in the game name, so it's just this is a test, so it's just test it, test, and normally it'd be like Spider-Man or something or anything like that. Well, I just, I press done, and then I have to go back, so puts it in. Anyways, so you move it from where you're supposed to go. So let's say you want to move uh, these games, like, uh, that is BSTHD, which is Blood some Sword, the uh, THD, um, Blood Outbreak, stuff like that. So if I want to say, if I want to remove, uh... Like, I don't know why, for some reason, it can't move Walking Dead. I don't know why, it just doesn't work. But, uh, that's just one game that doesn't work. I don't know why. Everything else works perfectly fine, so. Let's just try and go to Android, Data, and just pick a folder that you want to do. So if this folder's like tw like 20 gigabytes or whatever, you click it. Now, you don't go into anything else, you just go to the folder, and then it click Check. Uh, check. Okay. Would you like to create the destination folder? Yes, just click yes, and then it'll automatically move it to your, uh, oh, sorry, this one doesn't work. There are some that don't work as well, and it's kind of weird that it isn't, so. But anyway, let's just try and do Iron Pants, I guess, and yes. Okay, so the ones that don't work won't show the destination. Uh, let's see, let's go up and choose something random. Okay, here. So, okay, yeah. Yes, and there we go. See, it does it automatically to your SD card one, which is your external, and then you click this. Boop. Yes. It moves the files, and it, it will. I don't know why it does that, but before it, I uh, it, it worked for me. But anyways, uh, once that happens, it goes to 100, and uh, click this. You click the little pin button, and it says please wait. And once it's green, you know that. Oh, sorry. Well, okay, let's just click on all the pins. Let's wait here. Alright, so it'll have, it'll green, it'll be green, and, uh, that means it's done. So this one's already linked. We can unlink it. Let me just delete this one. Yeah, alright, so, click it. Weird, it's not, huh? Anyway, you get the point. It it links all of them to your uh thing, to your SD card. And once you're done with that, it should save you a lot of space on your uh, hard drive or thing. So this should say available, you know total like 16 gigabytes if it's full and yeah it should work like that well anyway this has been following solutions this is how to save space on your uh, android device and uh, have a nice day and there we go